The primary goal of the lungs is to take in oxygen and remove carbon dioxide during a normal breathing cycle. This process is referred to as gas exchange. As a respiratory therapist or medical professional, this is definitely a topic that you must be familiar with. And that is exactly why we created this quick video to help you learn some of the most important concepts. So if you're ready, let's get into it. First and foremost, how is oxygen transported in the blood? The majority of oxygen molecules are transported from the lungs to other parts of the body via red blood cells. Red blood cells contain hemoglobin, which is what picks up oxygen molecules so that they can move through arteries to the tissues of the body. One hemoglobin molecule is able to carry four oxygen molecules during transport. One cool thing to know is that when oxygen is bound to hemoglobin, this is what gives arterial blood its bright red appearance. Venous blood, on the other hand, appears darker because it is not carrying any oxygen molecules. Switching gears just a bit, now let's talk about CO2. How is carbon dioxide transported? CO2 is transported in the body in three ways. Bicarbonate, carb amino hemoglobin, or dissolved in blood plasma. Approximately 10% of carbon dioxide is transported by dissolving and diffusing into blood plasma. Approximately 20% of carbon dioxide is bound to hemoglobin and transported via red blood cells. And approximately 70% of carbon dioxide is transported as bicarbonate. Again, the basic concepts of how oxygen and carbon dioxide molecules are transported in the blood is a fundamentally important topic for respiratory therapists to understand. Hopefully this video was helpful for you, but we will be breaking it down even further in a future video. Real quick guys, do me a huge favor and hit the like button. It really helps support the channel and I greatly, greatly appreciate it. And while you're down there, go ahead and click the subscribe button as well because we have a ton of other videos on our channel that I think you will enjoy. Just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for educational and informational purposes only. And if you want to dive deeper and learn more about this topic, you can go to respiratorytherapyzone.com where we have a ton of free study guides, practice questions, and other helpful resources. I'll drop links to everything you need right below this video down in the description. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Have a blessed day and as always, breathe easy my friend.